good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever time of day it may be for you, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Layback Gamer, and we're back with another video. I'm not sure what it is, but it is bound to be, hopefully, a very exciting one. So yeah, we're back. And, well, you read the title, so you know exactly what we're going to be doing. So, if you like the video, leave a like. Maybe even consider subscribing if you really like the video. Ooh, that'd be very nice if you did. And, well, yeah. So sit, so go on, grab some food and a beverage. Maybe not one that's that fancy. Sit back and enjoy the show. Well, I'm going to keep it with a theme, and we're going to pretend that uh, Armabari from the main game had a... Well, he just happens to look exactly like this Mabars, so this one's name is also Pepper. Or Peppers. That's the name of my dog. Such a good dog. And yes, I am constantly trying to summon him. The storage here. Oh, that's stuff I can sort. Or, sorry, store. All right, let's do this. So we still have some work to do in Low Town. We also have a Black Emporium to check out, and apparently Dark Town. All right, let's go. Being a guardian seems like a better life than being a soldier. Oh, my brother was a soldier. It's all about taking land and serving some king you've never met. Guardsmen, they do something real. They protect people. They make their lives better. I don't know if I agree. Neither would my brother. Unfortunately, he's gone. It's a sad way to go. Uh, what's up, boy? People looking around down here. We do have to wait till nightfall. Elven alienage. The elves who don't live here actually have it worse. I hate to be an elf in Darktown. What's in Darktown? I brought my family there twice this year. What more does she want from us? They want to talk. Where's the entrance right here? Moth eaten scarf, but the money in there is nice. Jeez, this is far worse than the uh, alienage I've... Well, really, all the other alienages I've seen. I mean, I've seen all, all just about all the ones in this game. That's the way out. Yes. Yes, I did. Armor stand, armor, and some rubble. Please tell me there's a lot foundry district. A foundry district. Gotta wonder. Have you anything to spare? This place is absolutely depressing. I don't know why people want to get their way out of here. Make a turn in favor. I think there's some people in this place that needed a lot more than me. Oh yay, another amulet. What does this one do? Stamina slash magic of regeneration rate. Hold on. I guess that's the effectiveness on this one? I'm not sure. Oops. Alright, well, I suppose we should uh, pop in upstairs. And go find this... Uh, Grey Warden, who I believe is one of a couple people, I, but I don't actually know who it. I won't know who it is until we you talk again. to him. What do you want? I'm looking for someone. I hear you know where I can find a Ferelden Grey Warden. Only Ferelden Grey Warden I've heard of is sitting on the throne. We're out of the Blight's path now. Why would you need a warden? The Healer was one of them once, wasn't he? A warden. Well, he's not now. And busy enough without answering fool questions about it. Why so defensive? Who are you protecting? You see what our people face in Kirkwall. 
They have no jobs, no homes. Most can barely buy bread. This healer, he serves them without thought for coin. He's closed their wounds, delivered their children. And yet he needs to hide. He's a good man. I won't lose him to the blighted Templars. Lose him to the Templars? You mean he's a mage? Would I stick my neck out for some purveyor of hensbane and leeches? We would never turn someone over to the Templars, mistress. Never. He doesn't want to be locked in the gallows just for using the gifts the Maker gave him. Seems reason. Uh, let's go with this one. Your healer is in no danger from me. If this mage is an apostate, the Templars will find him. No mage should suffer for an accident of birth. I suppose it isn't my secret to keep. Anders has certainly been free enough with his services. Ah, uh, yes. Refugees in Darktown know to find the healer, look for the lit lantern. If you have need enough, Anders will be within. Ah, uh, yes, Anders. Oh, Anders, Anders, Anders. It's good to see you in the. It's good to see you. Uh oh. Hey, we heard you in there asking about the healer. We know what happens to mages in this town. And it ain't gonna happen to him. Bethany? Look, we're Vereldans just trying to keep out of the Templar's sight, same as you. Vereldan? But you, your clothes. I figured you for a Kirkwaller, sorry. Maker bless the rule of our King Alistair. Okay, well, I just avoided a lot. Of pain. It's a good thing we have a. Uh... To you, Sparrick. Have you penned some warnings for the lawless? Who's that for? The most criminals, big readers. Seems like pacifying the nobles. Pictures, then. It was just a suggestion. Well, how about a giant sign that just says "Don't"? You could hit people with it. Thank you. I get the point. <laughs> Uh, believe it or not, I love the banter in this game. Alright, we'll wait till nighttime in a little bit. We have to go back to Hightown for a quest anyways. Off to Darktown. Why do they call it Darktown? I think I'm seeing why they call it Darktown. Oh, jeez. Not more! Not again! I'm just going to stand back for two seconds. Even cast your fireball? No, you didn't. Okay, cast it, uh... Right here, please. Oh. Ah, thanks, Varric. Ugh. Very, very about that. Okay, well, that's good, at the very least. Why? It, 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 excuse me, citizen, what are you just doing staring at this fight? You're walking in the middle of it. Why? Why? Why are you people like this? I make room. Uh. Oh, come on. Keep attacking him. Come on. Nice try. Ah, thank you. Evelyn's a little bit injured. Did I not put this on you? Oh. I'm gonna put it in the wrong spot. Okay, Evelyn. My goodness, this is very pixelated. Alrighty, well. We have a quest up here. Tomwise. Hello. Tomwise? Huh? Oh, Hawk. Haven't seen you since we did that job together for Athenro. Been a while. 
heard you're going on some expedition into the deep roads and right into darkspawn territory sure that's wise it's a living we can't all make a living in the undercity just watch your back that's all i'm saying say you still in the market for some poisons a thin real scarce these days and the coterie have their own mixers you find any rare reagents and want me to whip you up something just let me know in fact since you're an old friend here's a recipe my speciality everyone needs an edge sometimes right yeah i desperately need some debilitating po poisons and grenades so we can order them from here all right nice gotta keep our eyes I'm sorry i couldn't get you more information about the circle bethany it's difficult without naming you thank you for being discreet i don't want the templars at my door no one does let them corral the troublemakers I just want information. Right. Right. It sounds like I'm trying to convince myself, doesn't it? I wouldn't have said, but yes. Oh, uh, yeah, really? I do feel bad for her trying to hide from the circle. Oh, jeez. Oh, yes. Light him up and knock him down. That's good to know. And I'm going after this mercenary. Good. All right, come on. All right, keep fighting, please. use that. I should probably also summon the Mabari. Keep forgetting to do that. Good. Good. And you're dead. Oh, at least the experience is nice. Hello. I'm sorry I can't offer you anything, apparently. Rule of thumb. If the criminal runs to the sewers, he's gone. Ooh, look at that. Death root. Excellent. I can reach things with a stick. I don't like this. I really don't like this. I'm going to save quickly. Hello. else you want to say this is my territory hmm. very chatty sort is he all right where is mr Anders anything I can't say where's miss Anderson that would be nice Kirkwall dark town I oh my. Where now? I don't really like it down this here. Is door. Let's go in and see why Gamlin lied. Ah, uh, just a second. I have a need. Talk to someone. I mean no harm. I'm just here to talk. 
We're interested in getting into the deep roads. Rumor has it you were a warden. Do you know a way? Did the warden send you to bring me back? I'm not going. Those bastards made me get rid of my cat. Forced to pounce a lot. He hated the deep roads. Oh, why would we ever do that? I'm sure my guy would never have done that. Even if it was annoying. Sir Pounce a lot. You had a cat named Sir Pounce a lot in the deep roads. It was a gift. A noble beast. Almost got ripped in half by a Genlock once. He swatted the bugger on the nose. Drew blood, too. The blighted warden said he made me too soft. I had to give him to a friend in Amaranthine. Okay, well, at least the cat's not dead. Uh, what are you doing here, then? So, you came to Kirkwall just to escape the warden. You say that like it's a small thing. Yes, I'm here because there's no warden outpost, no darkspawn, and a whole host of refugees to blend in with, and some reasons of my own. Okay. And people just leave the wardens. I've always heard that joining the wardens is for life. That's only partly true. The hopelessly tainted by the darkspawn and plagued by nightmares about the archdemon parts don't go away. But it turns out if you hide well, you don't have to wear the uniform or go to the parties. All right. I could use your help. I'm part of an expedition into the deep roads. Any information you have could save people's lives. I will die a happy man if I never think about the blighted deep roads again. You can't imagine what I've come through to get here. I'm not interested in... Although... A favor for a favor. Does that sound like a fair deal? You help me, I'll help you. What's the favor? Let's be more specific. I don't do anything involving children or animals. I have a warden map of the depths in this area. But there's a price. I came to Kirkhall to aid a friend. A mage. A prisoner in the wretched gallows. The Templars learned of my plans to free him. Help me bring him safely past them, and you shall have your maps. Alright, who is the mage? Tell me about your friend. His name is Carl Feckler. He was sent here from Ferelden when Kirkwall Circle required new talent. His last letter said the Knight Commander was turning the Circle into a prison. Mages are locked in their cells, refused appearances at court, made tranquil for the slightest crimes. I told him I would come. Circle, a prison? Are these accusations true? Ask any mage in Kirkwall. Over a dozen were made tranquil just this year. The more people you ask, the worse the rumors become. Ugh. I can kind of see why they have... Well, we'll not get it. Let's not get ahead of ourselves with that one. How'd the Templars find out? What do the Templars know of your plans? I don't know. I had been exchanging notes with Carl through a maidservant in the gallows. Then the letters stopped coming. And helped him escape the circle? You want to make your friend an apostate? That's such a weighted term. Yes, Andraste said magic should serve man, not rule him. But I've yet to find a mage who wants to rule anything. It goes against no will of the maker for mages to live as free as other men. I think I would say this in this context because our sister's a mage, so... Forcing mages into servitude is not the way to prevent the rise of another Imperium. That's not usually the response I get. Perhaps we will work together better than I expected. Alright, uh, so what's your plan? How do you plan to break him out of the gallows? I'm hoping it won't come to that. I sent Carl a message to meet me in the Chantry tonight. Make a willing, he'll be there, alone. But if there are Templars with him, I swear I'll free him from them. Whatever the cost. All right. I'm I'm in. You've convinced me. What's your plan? I welcome your aid. I have already sent word for Carl to meet me in the Chantry tonight. Join us there, and we'll ensure that no matter who is with him, we all walk away free. All right. Well, that's good. Anything else you can tell me, Anders? Carl won't be able to get away until it's dark. Meet me at the Chantry at nightfall. Will do. Now, I have a, uh, basement to break into. Alright. 
Uh oh. Uh. No, we're, we're fine at the moment. I'm trying to watch to make sure none of my companions cast any spells that would uh, severely hurt us. And unfortunately, Armabari is not here with us. Alright, stun! I think I'll hold off on the cool on our ability. Good. Alright, well, let's get to looting. Ooh, a fancy poison something. Sage rope. We really are just taking whatever garbage we can find. I said trap. Hello. Oof, I tried to get... Fortunately, not fast enough to dodge that one. Alrighty, activate that. Oh, you, 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 you got rid of the dog! Oh, this is going to hurt, this is going to hurt. Well, aren't you just a silly one? Why are you stuck down here? Why are you down here? Okay, you go after this one. I don't mind if I... Well, actually, I do mind a little bit. Alright, let's drink that. Nice. Okay, so we have a shield. Another healing potion, that's good. All right, at least we're starting to find some items now, which is fantastic. Sir Wesley's shield. Uh, this is uh, just better. Sorry about that. All right, and I got no other items. Got a chest in here. Portrait of my mother. Portrait of the past. Ooh, yes, I think I will. Your mum would be... Oh, hello. El... El Crest. Mother described it, but this is the first time I've seen it. Wouldn't it feel like something to live in a house with this above the door? <laughs> Oh, yes, it would. Yes, it would. Oh, bother. Fortunately, I can't just start the battle off. Firebolt. Hello. Okay, cast this just right here. Well, that, uh, that was rather unfortunate. Okay. I think I just saved Bethany with that, despite hurting her badly. Okay, uh, can I? No, not just yet. Who's getting backstab? Uh, Evelyn got backstab and severely injured. Alright, well, I am dreadfully sorry to have to do this to us. Oh, who am I kidding? I've, I'm not really. Uh, that did help. And uh, let's see here. Can I get a miasma right there? 
Oh, look at that. Look at those expert dodge traps moves. Oh, well, that's not good. Oh. Uh, that's a, that's not good. That is really not good. And of course you drank a health potion. For my abilities. Nice. Sorry about that, ladies. Uh, go ahead and just pop a couple injury kits. Not out of danger yet. I'm hoping I can find some uh, gauntlets. Hey, sweet! I found some better, better armor. And the Ferelden Field Gloves I've been wearing. Alright, I got a sack over there. Hope nothing else is in this. And I just walked into a... Okay, no assassins, so that's good. Hey, uh, Bethany, can I just get you to back up for a moment? Alright, yes, yes, beat them down, my friends, beat them down. Oh, I'm lucky that I did not get hit by that. Oh, uh, this is going to hurt. I'm just going to back up a little bit. Thank you. <laughs> I think our guys also backed up out of that conveniently, too. Fortunately, we don't get any, we're not getting any kill moves, which kind of sucks. Tree of Karakwal, Chapter 2. Broken bow, another health potion, okay. We're starting to get our health potions back up, and an injury kit. Alright, that's good. Now, uh, two injury kits, which is fantastic. Master Slaver. Well, this is, this just got bad. Slaver guard back there, another guard there, another guard there. Hey, uh, why don't you uh, just step over here for two minutes? Okay, we are uh, kind of getting outclassed here at the moment because of this uh, po poison. Yeah, I'm going to need to... I'm going to... I should probably restart this fight. Did I save this? Uh, okay, so uh, just a minute ago. Why don't you go disable this, please? Alrighty, so let's do this. Alright, good show, good show. Okay, you're about to use Burst Arrow. And I got a Miasma Blast to use back there, please. Where's the dog? Oh, the dog's getting the one that's behind us. Okay, let's just kill this guy for a moment. Okay, now focus back on the mage. Oh, well, no, nope, he's now in his shield again. Alright, fine, I'll use it on this one. Okay, nope, keep using it. Come on. Alright, we had a heal. Heal Evelyn, please. Yeah, I want to get this mage dead. Okay, uh... Toss another Miasma Flask. Right there, please. Evelyn's unfortunately going to take the brunt of that one. That's okay. Ooh. Alright, ca 
cast a fireball right here, please. Oh, good. And wait for the shield to come down. Oof. Sorry about that, dog. Oh, Imperial Blood Helm. And a Vault Key. Okay, that's good. Apparently we get full effectiveness on us. Oh, it's just restricted to us. Wow, that looks terrible. Is there an option that I can use to turn off? Because I don't want to... Gameplay... No, interface... Oh, yes, yes, yes. Hide helmet. Oh, much better. Alrighty. Beric? Your stuff. Ooh, a mask of the Imperia. Oh. Also, again, restricted to us. Oh, I suppose uh, this would. This is more of a. This is a rogue thing, so we could go ahead and sell this. And ours is better, anyways. Street of the Circle. The vault door is just up here. That's the vault. Everything we want to know about our family is inside. I'm gonna do this just in case. Chest. This and the will. Oh my goodness! This was worth it. This is it. Grandfather's will. Mother needs to see this as soon as possible. Let's go. We'll take it to her right now. Oh, that was a payday. Blood's blood and all, but you are taking advantage of my hospitality. It's only fair if you make something of a monthly contribution. You sold my children into servitude. Now you're asking me to pay rent? Uh, maybe just put something towards food. We found the will. He forgave you, Mother. Grandfather left you everything. Here, read it. Uh, ah, I should maybe... To my daughter, Leandra, and all children born of her. The estate in Hightown and all associated revenues. I'd say keep reading. Check out the part where Gamlin is left only a stipend to be controlled by you. Gamlin, how could you? You're the one who ran away, Leandra. What happened to love is so much more important than money. It is. You didn't even come home for the funeral. The twins were a week old. We all have our burdens. Mine was looking after a life you abandoned. How long was I supposed to wait? Did you wait one minute? I doubt you let the ashes get cold. I took care of father. I stayed. And on his deathbed, all he could talk about was Leandra. Look, sister, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. And there's nothing I can do to get it back. I don't expect that, Gamlin. It's enough to know mother and father didn't die angry. I'll petition the Viscount for rights to reclaim the estate. Make a willing. You'll have your house back within weeks. You don't have the coin or standing to even get an audience with the Viscount. You've got to be someone in this city to live in that house again. Then I had better get started. You're lucky I don't put my great sword up your back. Anything else to say? So, what? Are you here to gloat? Gamlin's the idiot again. Gamlin's the fool who can't hold his money when it's given in a bloody silver basket. I tried, you know, when Leandra left. But no one was ever going to live up to her. How did you lose the money? I've seen the nobles in this town. Your parents must have had a fortune. Where did it all go? Well, 
It's not like I stood at the side of the wharf and hurled it over. I tried to invest it. I got some good tips on trade in Kunhari cheeses. And, you know, a man's got needs. I'm not denying I spent more on myself than I should have, but I figured it'd all work out. Tell me about Mum. What was she like? As a girl, we're only a year apart. But that was time enough for Leandra to get our parents wrapped firmly around her little finger. They showed her off at every opportunity. The beauty, the scholar, the light of their lives. As far as they were concerned, they should have stopped there. The bid for attention? Honestly, I don't really like you. Don't make excuses. I changed their filthy sheets and wiped their chins through two bouts of the cholera, and the last word father said was... Leandra. I'm not looking for love, but at least I got the money. And here I was, just about to like you. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Hey, Bethany. Why don't you go pick up something at the market? You could use some air. What? Hey! <laughs> I can't believe Gamlin stole Mother's entire inheritance. I mean, I can believe it. That's the worst part. I would never turn against you. Turn over her. <laughs> Don't compare yourself to him. You're a better person than Gamlin could ever be. Well, hopefully we'll be out of here soon. You know, when we went to look for that will, I thought we were doing it for Mother, for what she lost. I didn't realize how much it would mean to me to know I had grandparents who didn't hate me. <laughs> I know just how you feel. I wish they had lived long enough to see us come home. Home. That's what it is, isn't it? I like saying that. We're not running away again. We're coming home. Again? What do you mean, running away again? Did you think I don't know? How often we had to move because the Templars were coming. I know how much you all sacrificed to protect me. But we're at the end of the line now. There's nowhere left to run. And there's something almost comforting in that. I avoid the circle. Why did mother and father work so hard to keep you from the circle? Would it have been so bad? I guess at first, I was just a little girl. They didn't want to lose me. And once I had learned anything, what would the Templars do to an active apostate, not just a made blood child? It changed their lives, your life, Carver's, all because of who I am. Sometimes I wonder if it would have been so bad to be with my own kind, to serve the Chantry as Andraste demands. You sound sad. Are you unhappy here? I wish I could do more for Mother. Carver's dead. It's killing her slowly every day. But maybe if we can reclaim some of what she lost, it will help. I'd do anything to get us back a normal life. Would have got what Car would Carver would have said. What do you think Carver would have made of all this? He would have hated this place. All the sneering nobles. He'd have gotten himself arrested the first day. And he would have wanted in on your Deep Rose expedition. Anything to make a name for himself. Sometimes I still can't believe he's gone. Uh, what would it have been like? Can you imagine if we'd grown up here, been nobility? Had grandparents who bought me Orlesian silk dresses and gave you the family broadsword? Father was a good man, but Mother gave up so much for him. Of course, if she hadn't worked up the nerve to elope, she probably wouldn't have been able to resist the Templars either. If we'd been born here, you'd be nothing more to me than a name the Circle kept in my file. We're home now. We are going to make this our home, Bethany. I promise you. I hope so, brother. I'm so very tired of running. Jeez, that just uh, hits you in the feels a little bit. Anyways, attributes. Uh, I'm going to go to 20 strength. 
And I need some extra constitution to keep myself alive. And what do we got here? Can't quite go on any of these yet. I don't I don't really want to be a Templar. It's kinda of sucky that we got we lost one of the trees, because I always went champion. Probably end up picking Berserker, honestly, by the end of this. Anyways, let's see here. So we have charge sunder. Let's go scythe. Let's do that. All right. Let's talk to Mum first before we I talk to Bethany. Mother, I was marrying your father. She threatened to disown me. She said my children would be mongrel. My father wanted to lock me in, but she told him it's her life. Let her ruin it. I wrote to her when each of you were born. She never wrote back. I'm glad she didn't die hating me. So, can we move the estate now? The estate is yours. Why are we still here? Technically, the house is now property of the Viscount, since its owner died without an heir. If we went there now, we would just be squatters. But if the Viscount acknowledges our rights, we can get back more than the house. We can get back our name. Mother probably... Mo Grandmother never probably hated you. Grandmother didn't want you to leave. She tried holding on to you the only way she knew. She would have been so proud of you. You're everything she wanted in the Namel grandchild. She might have had a hard time accepting it at first, but she would have loved you, all three of you. Carver. He was such a little boy. Never had a knee that wasn't scraped or trousers without holes. Yeah, we probably miss him. He was so young. Never got to be the man he wanted. I just keep thinking there's something we could have done. It's killing me. I, I remember that awful creature reaching down and 18 years of loving and feeding and raising and that was it. Nothing we could have done. Blame the darkspawn, not yourself. The ogre would have been happy with any prey. It was my fault it was Kava. I miss him. There were four of us when the blight began. It will never be over while there are just three. I've written to the Viscount. I've an audience for after Bartrand's expedition leaves. I couldn't do anything for Carver, but with luck, I could at least give us a home. Ah, uh, I hate to break it, but it it, it would have I it was gonna kill one of us. No, it actually, wasn't gonna kill us. We're uh we have plot armor, you see. All right, let's go talk to Bethany again. I found this when we were at the estate. I thought you should have it. Oh. Is it? I think this is Mother's betrothal portrait from when she was supposed to marry the Comte. Look. You can see the ring. Team excited. Team excited. You like it? I love it. My whole life, Mother's always been so sad and worried. All because of my cursed magic. I always wished there was some way to take that burden off her. It's nice to have a reminder of a time when she still knew how to smile. Jeez, that's just sad. Oh, we got some achievements too, nice. Anything else, Bethany? I hope Mother convinces the Viscount to give us the estate. Jeez, that just makes me feel sad. There's still a letter here. Uh, well, we need to wait for night time. Have duty down at the docks. Stuff to do here. I can't access the Vi can't access the Viscount's keep of the Chantry at night. We'll have duty and do some duties out here. Don't we have to go? I think we have to go to Sundermon for something. Uh, let's see here. You know what? Let's go to Low Town. In the middle of the night. Oh bother! Oh bother! The streets aren't safe at night. 
We should do something about that. And we're on our way. Oh, hold on. Have some character upgrades. All right. Wow, we have maxed out our friendship with Bethany. That's good to know. Although that's probably going to change. Let's say magic. Then... Heroic Aura, Paralyze, Haste, Ready to Heal. Oh, yes, I'll take that. Eveline. Oh, Constitution, a little bit of Strength. I can do this yet? I don't have friend. Oh, hold on a minute. Oh, yeah, I don't have that with uh, Beth. I don't have anything for Beth with that with Bethany just yet. Can't go bravery, but let's go tremor. Nice, we are talented. All right. We can't waste time, Hawk. Guardsman Donick is here somewhere. We're looking. My favorite spot in the whole city. The taverns in High Town are all owned by the Merchants Guild. <laughs> huh? Oh, jeez. Okay, let's use our new ability to charge right through them. Oh, nice. Well, at the very least, we're going to get some free experience from this. Oh, I think we got more people jumping in from above. Heavily, or it's not, sorry, Bethany, I mean. Heal up yourself. All right, I will be over there. Uh, maybe not as quick as we need. We need to be. All right, so I'm gonna get these guys to come over here. Also, this merchant is just standing around doing nothing. Okay, I'm gonna charge. Nice. Oh, this might hurt. Oh, actually, we just... I think we pushed one of them into the blast radius, so Bethany got one last firebolt out before her uh, untimely demise. Okay, what's... Oh, well, ain't that just wonderful. They're dropping in around us. Let's say, give that guy a nice pinning shot, please. Could you maybe stop dropping in? Oh, yes. And, uh, Mabari! Alright, come on. And go for him. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. I think that do yeah, the dog's gone. All right, well, good news is, is that these two are going to eventually be here. Oh, I unfortunately missed on all of them there. All right, yeah, I gotta accept, I'm just about to faint. Yep, I'm down. Yep, Hawk's down for the count. All right, Astrid right there, Eveline. Okay, activate shield defense. Okay, what do we got going on right now? Uh, cast that right there, please. Okay, how weak are you? Uh, now does Goat do anything for us? Okay, yeah, not really. Let's go after you. Uh oh. Uh, we're now being targeted. Uh, do I want to pop a potion? I think I'm okay for the time being. Okay, put a miasma right here. Oh, I guess not. Well, that's unfortunate.
<laughs> Good one. Nice. Ah, you're fine. You're good. We're good. Seriously, we're just going to keep autoing this. And you really don't do as much damage as I do. And again, you're built to be more of a tank, and Hawk is meant to be not. Broken statuette. Alright, what do we got? Are you answer? Ah! Sweet mother of Park. You can't just run up on someone like that. Are you? The human the Fenril told me about? The one looking for work? That's expecting someone else. Did you think I was going to attack you? Oh, no, no. Uh, all right. Hope not. Anyhow. My apologies, human. I haven't been on the surface very long. I keep thinking I'll fall up into that sky any minute. <laughs> Bargeron used to be like that. Got jumpy every time he stepped outside. What a bizarre thing to be scared of. But I digress. I need some help. Rather badly, in fact. Some product of mine has been misplaced. The men who were supposed to deliver it decided not to. If you retrieve my property, I could reward you handsomely. What kind of property is it? Just what did these men steal? <laughs> did I say steal? I don't know if I would go that far. They seemed like perfectly reasonable smugglers. They smiled and everything. The goods are valuable, however, and illegal. And my client wants them very, very badly. <laughs> you know how these Templars can be. So, Lyrium. You're smuggling Lyrium to the Templars. Maker's breath. Between the Chantry, the Carta, and the Coterie. Shh. By the Paragons, not so loudly. My word. I'm not cut out for this. I should have taken that job sweeping staples like Mother insisted. All right, done. I'll get it back for you. Sure, add it to the list of things I'm accessory to. Oh, thank goodness. The gentlemen conduct their business at night in a little hovel within the alienage. If you have to kill them, then I guess it can't be avoided. But I'm sure they'll be reasonable. Oh, Aveline did not like that. I'm about to be jumped if we come up here yet. Well, I guess we can loot this. You? A sack I can loot. I'll take all that. I'm gonna save up here, as I prefer not to die all of a sudden. Be rid of that that image. Oh, I didn't that again. Okay. Well, we at least have three more, or two more battles in us. Let's pop into the hangman. I think we can get our injuries cured if we pop inside. Nope, I lied. We can't. Suspicious lady. Don't bother me. Get healed if we say pay a visit to the room up here. Nope, I guess not. I wonder if anybody's ever done this on Nightmare. Okay, well, yeah, we gotta go back to... Oh, jeez, don't tell me they're gonna be spawned right outside again. Oh, don't tell me I have to fight them again. These streets should be safe at night. Care to help out with that? I don't mind helping out with that. The lady over there. Must be getting close to the ambush. I'm not losing another guard to this mess. Looks like he's uh, a little down at the moment. Okay, so mighty blow. Mighty blow, I said. And... Oh, I thought I avoided the attack. That would have been nice had I done that. Oh, that's bad. Oh, actually, hold on a minute. Do that right there. Cast that there. 
Cast this here. Did we take this off? Yeah, we did. Our guy, our guy did. Okay, drink. I don't trust this guy. I don't trust this. Okay, Evelyn, you take care of that. I'm gonna come over here. Take care of this. You, uh, pop over back here, please. Oh, lovely. The quarter leaders are busy trying to kill us. Can I get you to heal Evelyn up, please? Alright, where is this leader gonna pop? The leader just popped up over here. Okay, so... Nice. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. 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 I don't think... Oh. I know what injuries are, but he's really injured. Details. City accounts. Valuable to a guild of thieves. A sacrificial delivery was one of our own. Captain Jevon will answer. Political scheme. Selling out his own. Forget guard, Captain. This man needs to be in government. Not now, Hawk. Jevon needs to see how justice works. This goes to the office of the Viscount. This will be known. The Captain likes his thieves so much. Let's see if they welcome him in prison. All right. What else can you say? Back to the barracks. Thank you for your help. All right. You're quite welcome. I shall take a bunch of this stuff. You are already very well off. Oh, a short bow. Can I equip one of these? No, of course I can't. I don't. I don't have the archery. Uh, that's one thing I don't like. This would be the game to be able to use these weapons in, for us to be able to switch over to a... Because I, I didn't really do that too much in the previous game, but you can have your rogues at... Sorry, not your rogues. Well, you can have rogues and warriors using bows. And it would be quite useful to be able to, t to pelt your opponents with some archer attacks, and then, as soon as they get in close, then you switch over to your melee weapons and then start fighting them. I didn't really may take too much advantage of that last time, though. Alright, anyways, uh, to character, I'd like to level up your dexterity for that 10% critical chance. Yeah, actually, I want to just keep going, or do I want to go cutting as well? I'm going to go cutting for a little bit, increase our critical damage. Then what do we got? Scoundrel, Marksman, Sabotage, Go Bianca, Hail of Arrows. Yes, please. Alright. If I'm correct, I think those two might end up getting married later, if I remember. All right, well. Oh, this is good. Oh, jeez. Oh, good lord, look at them all. Yeah, I need you to do this here. Evelyn, you go after this one. I'm just going to hold back here for a minute. Ah. Oh. Thing right, can I? Oh, nice. Alright, that's two of them dead. Alright, on to the next highwayman. Actually, we'll take care of this guy since she's weak. 
And now they're coming in droves again. Lovely. Just when you use up all of your abilities, they start coming at you. Wonderful. I get a heal on us. Varric, uh... Work some magic here. Oh, I'm probably gonna be getting a little more injured. Alright, Captain. Activate that, please. Activate your tremor on that one. Oh, jeez, where are you casting that fireball? Oh, Eveline. Oh, no, you're fine. Good. No, uh, on you, please. Nice. Alright, come on. Oh, my goodness. Would you guys stop? Oh, Varric's down. Oh, Varric is down. Okay, grab that, please. Alright, good job. On to the next one. I got this one. Alright, Bethany almost up with the heal. Nice. Ooh! Uh, I'm sorry. Oh, well, at least you had the heal ready for yourself. That's good. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm sorry about that. Oh, and there's another one down there. Of course. Just when I think we're done. I agree. No oh, poor Varric, he's almost dead already. And welcome back. You have made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed, hit that subscribe button if you really enjoyed, maybe share this video to anybody who you think will enjoy my content, and also don't forget to check out some of my other stuff. I don't only, I'm not only doing this game, but I also have done a ton of other games. Well, a ton, I think, in cap, well, I'm not sure how many games I've done at this point, but anyways, here's a little, small little bit of collection of games that I've done. If you look on screen, it should take you to either another video or a playlist. Maybe you'll enjoy that. Perhaps you might not. I don't know. We will find out. Hope you all enjoyed, and until next one, take it easy.